Hey everyone, Dana with the OT Guide. Today I'm gonna to show you all one of my absolute favorite resources for teletherapy and in-person therapy. If you haven't heard of artforkidshub.com, be prepared for your therapy practice to be made 10 times easier. It's an amazing free resource that is a collection of basically hundreds of video tutorials on how to draw our students' favorite characters. So anything from Fortnite to Sonic to Paw Patrol to Disney characters, seriously, everything under the sun. Not only drawing, but they have origami activities, painting activities, holiday crafts, and it's free. So if you're a parent, teacher, or therapist that has a student who loves artwork, this is the perfect resource for you. I love it because it challenges our students' fine motor skills, so their ability to manipulate objects and coordinate movements in their fingers. It challenges their visual motor skills or their ability to copy what they see. And it also challenges their executive functioning uh, or their ability to you know, follow multi-step directions and sequence steps of a task. So it's amazing. Let me show you how incredible this resource is. Let's check it out. So this is artforkidshub.com. This is the adorable family responsible for making all of this free art. So let's say I wanna do a visual motor drawing activity. So I go to how to draw and look at all of these options they have. Animals, buildings, characters, sports, toys, school. So I'm gonna to go to characters. And look at all these characters they have. And I mean, it is like pages and pages of this. Like, they have Princess Tiana, like Bowser, Luigi, so many. Look, 14 pages of it. So let's click on one. Let's learn how to draw SpongeBob. So you click on the video. They tell you what art supplies you need. Hey, awesome. Who are we going to draw today? SpongeBob. Yeah, we're going to draw SpongeBob. That same length ahead. line on the right. Then we're going to draw a line that connects back up to the smile on each side. Now it's starting to look like SpongeBob. Yeah. Okay, now let's draw his pupil. First, we're going to draw. So as you can see, this is a 25-minute video, but they have three-minute videos. They have five-minute videos. Let's do a shorter one. Let's do how to draw a cat. Let's do the scary black cat for Halloween. Hey, our friends. Today we're going to draw another silhouette. That means you can see the out. And then back down. Then let's draw another ear on the right side, up and back down. We're also going to draw this black cat scared or angry. Yeah, and we're going to color it in all the way, so it's just going to be pitch black. So as you can see, he goes nice and slow, and you can always pause the video when you're showing it to your student. So that's drawing. Let's check out origami. So I click on origami for kids. Now you don't need origami paper to do origami. You can just cut a square off of your printer paper or construction paper. But look at all of these origami activities. My internet is being a little slow, but again, they have pages, 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 and pages of this. Scrolling back up, let's check out painting. Look at all this. So cool. And then they have specific holiday specific projects. So birthday, Mother's Day, Halloween, Christmas, Hanukkah, seriously everything. So anyway, it is super cute. It's so fun for our students and it's free. So I really, I really recommend you check out this resource, artforkidshub.com. It will make your therapy practice easier. Anyway, I hope today you guys had fun. If you like what you saw today, please feel free feel free to subscribe to my channel to support it. And if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, as always, comment below. I look forward to seeing you all next time. Bye.